two. That is Y2K from ETA. This is Local Musician Spotlight on CNN 1190. Alan Ayo here with Dick Holliday and Victor, a.k.a. Dr. Brushkoff from ETA. What does ETA stand for? Now, we recently witnessed you guys live on stage, and ETA had a fairly new abbreviation. Uh, right now, it's Elvis Took Acid. Elvis Took Acid. What are some of the other abbreviations um, that it's been before? It, well, previously, it was uh, In This All. And that's kind of, that's right. when you say that, it's very difficult to understand and a lot of people are like what and so we decided we wanted something that was easier the easy to remember pretty much I think that does that and before that it was just regular uh, estimated time of arrival but we changed it before that so. estimated time of arrival that's what I didn't know yeah that was that was when it was uh, bro uh, dick was not in the band at the time we had a, a, a female singer at the time and uh, it was a little bit really? little bit yeah yeah it was a it was pretty interesting we had a lot of reincarnations before it was uh, ETA. We were a, a techno rock band with techno beats behind the, the rock guitars. Sort of like Icelandic dance music. <laughs> you like? Yeah, something like that. That's wow. where they found me. They so found... like a cross between like Sugar Rose and DJ Kioki. Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah, exactly the bands I was not thinking about at all because I don't know who they are. Tell everybody where they can go online to check out your band. You can go to myspace.com forward slash ETA band, which I think is the best place to go to listen to our music, but I might just be mentally retarded. No, Do you know better place. places? <laughs> no, that's a good place, but we you know we're on GarageBand and pretty much any any website I, that I, we're able to find we're putting our music and they on can there. search you guys out by e dot um, t dot a dot right right that there is the best way but if you put Elvis Tech Acid it should come up there is an yeah. issue also on iTunes we are on iTunes oh yes we are on iTunes and so if you go to iTunes and find us under ETA because we could not be e dot t dot oh, a they wouldn't take the dots huh well, yes there is a, a Bolivian a ETA uh, but they are in like Germany or somewhere Bulgaria. Overseas. But they're Bulgaria. not even a band anymore. And it wow. was a 2005 record, and we've had the name since, like, 2001. So <laughs> we own the rights. And is there another show on top? I know you guys just played a show last weekend, but is there another one booked right now? Um, we are playing a lot in Oklahoma on the 30th of January, and we are playing at Pitchers in Arlington on the 5th of February. And you can, if for any other future dates, just check out our MySpace. That's oh, excellent. can I plug one more thing? Yes. I'm sorry to be a nice guy. What I just wanted to say, in? no, I do put blogs up on um, on YouTube now. I just started, and they're completely retarded. One's about my spider, my tarantula, and the other is now going to be this. So you'll get to see this. That's it's a right. dick holiday. A rolling video right now. D-I-K holiday. Space holiday with one L. That's what you want to search on YouTube to check out uh, Dick's online video blogs. Uh, okay, we're going to go out with one more song from ETA. Uh, the show has been brought to you from The Absolute Space. Check us out at theabsolutespace.com. This is Local Musician Spotlight, part of Innovation at Work on CNN 1190 with Winston Edmondson. I'm Ellen Ayo, and thank you to Dick and Victor for coming in today. Thank you. Your punk rock rocks, and here's evidence of it. We go out with an ETA song called Holden on CNN 1190. There you go. That's a wrap. Okay. Woo!